Hey everybody, in this video tutorial I'm going to show you how to backdate a Facebook post. This is just going to be a quick video tutorial, so if you want to get more details about backdating Facebook posts, then check out our more detailed blog post on ryhex.com where we also share some additional information. You can also find hundreds of tutorials there on social media and Facebook page marketing for absolutely free. One more thing before the tutorial, if you want to get more Facebook page followers, more organic reach, without running Facebook ads, then check out our Facebook page growth checklist that you can download from our website, ryhex.com, since we are giving it away for free. Links to the 50 point checklist in the description below. All right, so one thing you have to keep in mind is that you have to have a Facebook page to be able to backdate Facebook posts. And you also have to use the Facebook Creator Studio to backdate a Facebook post. If you try to post from your Facebook page, you won't be able to use this functionality. So all you have to do is open up uh, Facebook Creator Studio. You can reach this by, by opening the URL business.facebook.com slash creator studio. And you will arrive to a page something like this. And one thing you have to make sure is that you select Facebook at the top here, not Instagram. So you will see all the Facebook pages you can post from and backdate the Facebook post. And to create a new backdated Facebook post, all you have to do is click on create new here, select create post, then scroll down on the right here and select the Facebook page uh, you want to backdate the, this Facebook post from. And as this is a Facebook post, we don't have to necessarily add a photo or video. We just have to add something here. And as you can see, Facebook will preview your post and you can also have other features you can uh, do like scheduling Facebook posts and stuff like that. But what we need right now is to backdate the Facebook post. And so instead of clicking on the publish button here, we can click on this down arrow here and click on backdate here. And now we can set basically any time that was in the past. So let's say somewhere in 2021 and we can also hide it from a newsfeed if we want to do so. But if this is the date we want to have on the post to backdate it to, then click on save and uh, we can click on the backdate button and this post will be created on our newsfeed and with the backdated date and time. Before we would wrap up, just make sure to check out our free Facebook page growth checklist so you can get the 50 checkpoints we use every time to 10x the number of followers of any Facebook page. We are planning to charge money for this checklist in the future, so get it now for free until you can. You can get the checklist by clicking in the description below or search on Google for ROIHacks.com and uh, add the query Facebook page growth checklist spreadsheet. Also, if you want to learn more about setting up, managing, growing a Facebook page, make sure to check out our Facebook page tutorial YouTube playlist that you can see on the screen here. See you next time.